Hey everyone, Swordust here, and welcome back to Undertale. Okay, so... Last we left off, um... Yeah. Just utter confusion over who... Who I am, actually. Because apparently... Me, like, you know, butts, I've seen myself in videos. Um... Videos from the past with... With, uh, Toriel... Asgore and Azriel, their son. And that was like their foster child or something. I don't even know. And I, I don't know how this makes sense. But I mean, all I can do is just accept what's going on right now and move forward. Hopefully it all makes sense. Oh. Okay, so this is the room that uh, was all fogged up before. And those things I was observing were fridges. But they're empty. I'm pretty sure that the... That what I felt were not empty fridges. But... That aside, uh... Entry 19. The families keep calling me to ask when everyone is coming home. What am I supposed to say? I don't even answer the phone anymore. Oh... I mean, oh, whoa. Uh... I saw that move. Yeah, there it is again. It's a refrigerator. It seems to contain samples of some kind. Uh, entry 20. Asgore left me five messages today. Four about everyone being angry. One about this cute teacup he found that looks like me. <laughs> Thanks, Asgore. What? Why are you moving? It's a refrigerator. It's empty. Are you sure? Because that thing is shaking. Is something wrong with it? Uh, boy. Entry 21. I spend all my time at the garbage dump now. It's my element. <laughs> Yeah, we know that about you now, Alphys. <laughs> it's a refrigerator. It seems to contain samples of some kind. Again. And then this is a refrigerator, and it's also empty. Okay. What? What? What the hell? <laughs> oh my god. It's so cold. And this music... I don't even know. And what is this? It's like... It looks like Snowdrake? Is this his mom? That went missing? Or, or, or like, I don't know. It looks like there's like Vegetoids, Vegetoids attached to her too. What the hell is going on? Um... Joke. You told a bad pun about snow. Her expression starts to shift. <laughs> I remember. Oh my gosh, she can't even muster enough any, like anything to attack. She smells like a salty slush. Oh my god. What am I? Hey, this is just sad. Kind of creepy with the music. <laughs> you laugh and keep on laughing. It's so funny, you can't stop. Tears run down your face. What the hell? What? You didn't do that? I... It'd be weird if I did. No. Yeah, this is definitely Snowdrake's mom. This is... Just... Oh, man. I told a bad pun about snow. Her expression changes more. <laughs> Thank you. Jeez, this is just, I don't know what to say, <laughs> it's kind of sad. You told a bad pun about Snow, she's completely calmed down. You won. But how am I supposed to feel about that? What the hell? You found a blue key on the ground, you put it on your keychain. And yeah, I've been through here. Alright, so I think I have all 
all the keys now, and that fridge is still shaking. Like, really? You're, you're nothing? Cool. Oh, boy. Like, that fridge, I think, was a red herring, wasn't it? Friggin' misleading me. <laughs> Jeez. Okay, well... All that's left for me is to put the key in the slot. Let's save. Oh, boy. Um... Yeesh. So... Okay, we just have to open the door. I'm s I still, I'm just trying to process what's going on here. Like, who am I? What happened to all these things? Like, do they, are they like forever like this? Is there a way to change them back? Oh man, oh whoops. I was supposed to put the blue key back in the slot. I forget stuff. Ooh boy. Um Jeez, yeah, this is like is this reversible or, or are they just like this forever and they have to deal with it? I don't know. And who the hell am I? <laughs> what the heck, man? I was in the past, and I'm still here, and am I like a reincarnation of Butts, who's also named Butts? Oh, so many questions, not enough answers. And, whoa. Okay, oh, I guess that just always undoes itself now. Creepy. Um door should be open now. We can find what's on the other side. But first, I feel like I want to save. Always smart to do that. Ooh. Another elevator? Seems like another elevator has lost its power. Okay, no power in the elevator. Oh, more in... Or not. Seems to be turned off. Cool. Guess they'll be turned on if I turn on the power here. This. That doesn't look ominous at all. <laughs> it looks. I know it's just a machine, but it looks like it has a heart and two eyes and a weird crackled smile. I don't like this. This seems like the controls. Like this controls the elevator's power. Turn it on. No. Yeah. What now? What the hell? What the hell? Uh, not cool. Not cool. Not cool. Bad touch. Bad touch. Get away from me. Hey, stop. I got you guys some food, okay? <laughs> okay, so they're just hungry? N sorry about that. They get kind of sassy when they don't get fed on time. Well, thanks, I guess. I think they smelled the potato chips on you, or you had, and... Great. Uh, I did have potato chips on me. Anyway, uh, the power went out, and I've been trying to turn it back on, but it seems like you were one step ahead of me. This was probably just a big inconvenience for you. Wait, so where have you been? Like, I thought you were already down here, but apparently not, and... I got here before you somehow, I guess the elevator did kind of malfunction, but where were you this entire time? But I appreciate that you came up here to back me up. As I said, I was afraid I might not come back. But that's not because of these guys or anything. I was just worried I would be too afraid, Oh, to tell the truth that I might run away or do something cowardly. Oh. She was contemplating suicide. Oh my god. This is supposed This is such a cartoony game, but what the hell, dude? So many freaking adult themes. And oh, the feels. Poor Alfie's. There's always a better way, man. 
You don't have to off yourself. Uh, I... I suppose I owe you an explanation. As you probably know, Asgore asked me to study the nature of souls. During my research, I isolated a power I called determination. Yeah, I know. I injected it into dying mon monsters so their souls would last after death. But the experiment failed. You see, unlike humans, mon uh, unlike humans, monsters' bodies don't have enough physical matter to take concentrate those concentrations of determination. Their bodies started to, started to melt and lost what physicality they had. Pretty soon, all of the test subjects have melted into those. Ah. So their bodies started to melt because they couldn't handle all the determination and kind of became these weird amalgamate things. Seeing them like this, I knew. I couldn't tell their families about it. I couldn't tell anyone about it. No matter how much everyone was asking me. And I was too afraid to do any more work, knowing everything I had done so far had been such a horrific failure. But now... Now I've changed my mind about all this. I'm going to tell everyone what I've done. It's going to be hard. Being honest. Believing in myself. I'm sure there will be times where I'll struggle. I'm sure there will be times where I screw up again. But knowing deep down that I have friends to fall back on, I know it will be a lot easier to stand on my own. Thank you. Whoa. Come on, guys. It's time for everyone to go home. Huh. Okay, well, she pretty much just reiterated all the things I learned on those, uh, entries. But... But I guess now she's figured she, or she figured she'd just finally make a change on her own and be brave about it. That's good. Are these on now? What? Why are you a red smiley face? Entry number eight. I've chosen a candidate. I haven't told Asgore yet, because I want to surprise him with it. In the center of his garden, there's something special. The first golden flower, oh boy. That grew before all the others, of course. The flower from the outside world. It appeared just before the queen left. I wonder, what happens when something without a soul gains the will to live? So she took the flower, put a soul in it, I guess, and thus Flowey was born, wasn't he? Entry number 18. And the flower's gone. Yup. Ooh, but... Hmm. Whoa, okay. Ring. It's a voice you have never heard before. What the? Why is it? Why is the text so slow and creepy? But are you there? It's been a long time, hasn't it? But you've done well. Thanks to you, everything has fallen into place. But, <laughs> but. See you soon. What? Okay, not again. Not again. <laughs> Where am I going this time? What? This looks like the castle. The door is jammed shut with vines. Huh. Um... How did that elevator even get here? I won't ask, but I'm back here at New Home in the castle. Yep. Who sent me here? Was that... I don't know. What is happening? <laughs> I... 
I'm so lost. Um, it's not even a save point here, but oh, I didn't, I didn't explore any further here before. What's over here? A uh, staircase. How did I miss this? Oh, I guess I just felt like what? Oh shoot! So this is these are. It's a coffin. There's a name engraved on it, but it's empty. Of course, it's my freaking coffin. But the others, oh jeez. <laughs> oh man, it just solidifies that yes, Sasgore has killed six other humans. Oh boy. Oh boy. Yeesh. It's the little details that count, guys. The little details that remind you of your mortality. <laughs> oh boy. Okay, so I guess... I guess we're back to fighting Asgore again at the end over here. Huh. Well, I think I'll end it here. It's a good... I think this is a good place to end it. Oh, jeez. Oof. What is going on? Okay, well, anyway. Thanks, everybody, for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And if you want to see what happens for this fight, I don't know if... Any, like, I guess something's going to be different here. Don't forget to hit that bell, because we're going to be doing that next time. Trying to figure out, like, who the hell I am. And, and what's going to happen from here on out after learning the truth? Ah, oh, boy. Anyway, thanks again for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one.